Hey guys, today I'll be going through how to install Painting Light and yeah, we'll be needing Anaconda here. Um, if you haven't, if, if you haven't downloaded it, um, you can refer it to, I think, is this video starting from around 1 minute 30 to 4 minutes. Uh, it'll, it, it has a quick run through on how to install it. And yeah, so basically let's start with today's installation of Painting Light. It's pretty straightforward. Um, so basically what you want to do is you want to go to a destination you want to install your um, your Painting Light program. So uh, I usually do it on my, oh, um, I usually do it for, for a specific path. So I'll want to, if, if you can install it like here if you want, but I usually do it on my tutorial drive. I mean G drive and in the tutorial folder. So I'll just copy and paste that here. So you type CD and then paste the destination and then I have to go to my G drive since this drive is on C drive right now. And then once I'm in G drive, um, I'll want to here get clone click clone this repository so you just copy and then you right click to paste and then you can clone this whole repository here and now after finish cloning oh it's taking a while so after it finishes cloning you will want to create a conda environment so let's go conda create dash in um, let's call this PL2 since I already have another version of PL. So you guys can name it PL, but you just have to keep in mind when I mention PL2, you guys have to type in PL2. And you want the Python version equals 3.6. And yeah, you create this environment. And wait, I had a typo, my bad. There you go. Um, Next thing is you have to type in conda activate pl2. Um, so you can see the base turns into pl2 or pl, then it means you're ready to install stuff. So basically, what you just did here is created a virtual environment, and you will want to install all these um, libraries under that vir virtual environment. So Now you just have to install each and every one. So you just copy and paste line by line after everything says successfully installed. Okay. And some may take more time and you just have to be a bit patient. And yeah, keep installing all your stuff line by line be sure to check if it's success with its installation and here's the second to last one and here's the last one since we're only using windows not linux so we need this line specifically you don't need li uh, any linux line so just this line Oh right, um, I exited it out, so I need to go back into the file, painting light file here. So let me go in. Okay, so I'm in the code file. So here I installed this. Now when everything is done installing, you go to the bottom of the page and you can see this line here. And then you copy it to a text document or something and then so we find your target image that you want to play around with and you drag it into this code folder so this is the painting light folder and you go to the code folder so you move before you move check the file type it's a jpeg right so jpeg and then fma.jpg there you go and you move it here you copy it here and you copy this line and then you enter it press enter and now it will begin its rate interacting yes and 
it usually takes around 30 seconds so you might have to wait depending on your okay now it's done so you can see the results here and yeah you can basically just scroll around you don't need to press anything you just have your cursor around and then once you're done you you gotta have to re either take a screenshot or record if you want the result and once you're done uh, this clothing thing doesn't work so you have to press your anaconda prompt right here and then you have to press Control and C which is a keyboard interrupt so you basically cancel this and stop it from running so now um, another important thing is that if you want to use a mask like here you have to produce make a mask yourself so let me get an example here um, here so I have this photo here and then I made a mask myself in Photoshop so so now if you want to use a mask um, you had to specific uh, specifically edit this file called default you can open it in let's try what other options are there let's see if it works in notepad it probably works so if you are using um, two inputs and what you need to do here is since you need two inputs so you have to change this a bit up so you need to type a hash here and then you copy this line and you paste it here and you change this value to mask and then you change this to two and then if you're using a mask you have to do this if you're not you have to reverse back to uh, normal which you have to do hashtag and then remove the hashtag okay so let's reverse back to when we have two inputs where one is the original image and one is the mask image so let me paste these two images here so you can see they're both inside this code file right so now you edit go back to your text pad thing um, you will need to type 6.png since my file are both png files and then now you have two inputs here so you copy and then you input it here and press enter and yeah so if you want a mask you have to physically change the code here and if you don't need the mask anymore you have to edit back out so hash is basically mean like disabling this line of code and now you want this back so we don't have any mask now if we are going back to one input okay so that's about it so let's wait for this result and we can see okay now it's done and you can see the results here you can you can kind of see the mask line here a bit but mm, it's, it's not that obvious and yeah that's about it um thank you guys for watching join my discord if you have any problems oh yeah uh i forgot to mention Control c to close and if you want to reuse your environment you have to type conda activate pl2 and if you're done you just close it so if you're in base if you're uh if you already created the environment and you're in base you have to type conda activate um, pl2 and then you'll go back into the virtual environment and then you go to this file location and you can run this line of code yeah and yeah that's about it thank you guys for watching